Welcome back to our show, National Beer Graphic. Today on a very special event, we will be talking about the Hermit Crab. The Hermit Crab is a very unique species, which it has right here, the Big Claw. The Big Claw is used for many things, such to use to build buildings. Ah! Anyway, it uses to pick up small rocks to use for its house. It also uses it, as you can see, to pinch other objects, which it did to me. If you can get it to wake up, it has other things in it, such as antennas, which are used for the taste buds. The hermit crab is a very picky creature and will only eat specific stuff such as small monkeys and snails. Also, it, as you can see, the coloring on it, it has a very unique stuff and blends in with most of its surroundings. If you put it on your hand, you cannot see the hermit crab anymore, and only its shell. No hermit crab, and it goes undetected by many species. As you can see now, the hermit crab, he is coming out of his shell. You can see his eyes are very adapted to the light, and can adjust a look into the night light, daylight, and mid light. Red lights, orange light, purple light, blue light, and of course, the indigo light. The hermit crab shell is also used for stuff such as crawling around. It uses it in a special way as a motor. When the hermit crab starts to run, the motor powers up with adrenaline. As you can see here, he moves with great speed. The hermit crab gets very excited like this and usually uses this same move for breeding. The hermit crab is a very beautiful creature. As you can see the coloration, much like strawberry. And that is why this certain hermit crab is called a strawberry hermit crab. When a hermit crab gets scared, when a hermit crab gets scared, it will go into its shell for much protection from animals such as snails, fish, and other invertebrates such as the yellow jacket bumblebee. The hermit crab also has a unique leg. The leg right here, as you can see, is used as its reproductive gland. It uses this on females and both males because it has two genes in it. It can be played both roles and can reproduce on its own. Very special creature in this way, so you have to be careful because because it can breed with other animals like human. I have to keep it away from my lower body because if yeah, they breed very quickly, and if I don't watch it, it could do it to me. So this is all the time we have on our show today. Next week we will talk about a new animal, mystery animal, very spooky. All right. See you later. Oh my god. <laughs>